Hello everyone, today I want to show you how to create a pre-search node and become a pre-search node operator. Uh, pre-search is a decentralized search engine, uh, just like Google, but decentralized. So um, and you can make money along the way. So let's get into it. All right, so you're going to head over to presearch.com and you're going to get this pre-search default search uh, screen. What are you looking for today? It looks really clean. I love it. Uh, it's decentralized, private. Uh, they're looking. At, they're doing a great job. Uh, by default, the search engine is pre-search, uh, but you can also choose YouTube, Google, DuckDuckGo, EtherScan, CoinGecko, etc. Um, once you sign up, you're gonna get access to this menu. You're gonna be able to customize the page. Uh, you're gonna learn more about pre-search and the company. So I said decentralized, private, uh, and today I'm gonna show you how to run a node. Um, you can learn more about the pre-search ecosystem, uh, the pre-search token specifically. Uh, there are videos here about the CEO. Uh, I've I, I watched uh, several of those, very good. Uh, the pre-search token is based on Ethereum, so Ethereum uh, manages all the security and all that. That's the contract address. Uh, all right, so let's get into how to become a pre-search node operator and make a pre-search token along the way and make money along the way. All right, so once you sign up, you're gonna have access to this menu. You're gonna go to node stakes, and then you're gonna have this uh, node uh, dashboard uh, and your node registration code. You're gonna need this code right now; it's hidden, but you're gonna need this code to to create a node. Uh, right now, I have thirty-six thousand free token stakes, and let me see, fifteen uh, nodes. So I created fifteen nodes. These nodes uh, provide me with uh, pre tokens every month. They generate pre tokens. You can see since since I created the first one, that was uh, February this year, my first one. Um, when they started, that was a test net uh, network, and um, you only were required 2,000 uh, pre, pre tokens to stake or to stake to create an node. But now you need 4,000. See my latest ones, you need 4,000. Uh, <clears> so you want to start like creating your nodes now. Uh, who knows in the future they may need uh, they may increase that requirement. Uh, my 36,000 pre tokens. Uh, they're currently to see. They're currently. And KuCoin, we can check as of today, December 29th, 2022. They're three cents, three three point four cents. Um, they're generating my four, my 15 nodes. They're generating about 2,130 uh, pre tokens per month, which is an equivalent of 68% annual APR. Mm -hmm. uh, so it's not it's not bad at all. Uh, in the future, I hope you know uh, pre token. If you see the history of, of, of pre search, uh, it's uh, you know, this entire. Uh, history of pre-search, uh, all-time hams was 70, 77, went down, long period, you know, that was in back in uh, 18, yep, January of 18, was uh, now a, a new high recently in October last year, and then uh, it went down from there, but then the next uh, bull run, I hope, you know, it breaks this 70, 77, 76, 77 uh, cent all-time high, so if that Let's let's assume we you know, went back to like a one. We break that and went back. I hope we can make uh, around. Yeah, that will be my two thousand tokens. Two hundred. It will be equivalent to two thousand. We'll see how many. Uh, the reward system as well. Right? If it changes, but yeah, that's 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 the idea that we start like creating these nodes right now. All right. So let's go back to the nodes uh, dashboard and let's transfer some pre. I, here you can see the available to stake. And we need to have at least 4,000 pre in order to create a node, right? So we're gonna transfer some pre. Um, I have some unclaimed pre earned from my from my notes here, 15 notes. Uh, that's not enough. Uh, but I'm gonna go ahead and claim it right now. You can click claim, claim now. All right. So give it a second there, and it's gonna show uh, some time there. But in the meantime, you probably won't have anything here, so you need to go ahead and transfer pre. In order to do that, you're gonna click here, transfer pre from blockchain and that's the address you're going to use okay you're going to copy that address this is the address you're going to send your pre to now we're going to we're going to we need to purchase those pre and we're going to use qcoin okay let's go to qcoin um i have some usd that i transferred so i have 105 usd i'm going to go ahead and, and purchase um my pre tokens uh the that's pre perfect all right so now let's go ahead and purchase some pre I do, I'm gonna do 100% of my USDT. I'm gonna do a market order, market, and buy pre. All right, I got my pre, and now I'm gonna transfer that pre from my trading account 
into my um, main account. So trade account, pre-transfer, all my pre. I, I was able to get 3,127. So click there, transfer from my trading account into my main account. All the pre, go ahead, confirm. Yep, all right. So that's my pre on my main account. So once you have your pre on your main account, you what you wanna do is you wanna withdraw those pre and send them directly into your uh, dashboard. Withdraw, and that's the address we use, right? Uh, where is the address? Give me one second. Yes, that's the address we should let me copy it again just to make sure. We're gonna paste the address there. Perfect. And we're gonna select the network. The network is gonna be Ethereum ERC20. Make sure that's the one selected. It's a $3.32 fee. I'm gonna select that, confirm. All right. I think we're gonna select all here. So the amount I'm gonna transfer all my pre, the Ethereum network, and the address. Yeah, let's go ahead and withdraw this. Yep, confirm. And now you need to verify. I'm gonna put my password. Then I need to send myself an email. I'm gonna get the email. Give me one second. All right, I got my email. That's the code I was sent. And now my 2F FA code, which is in the app, in the validation app. You should have when you sign up or click on authentication. All right, I'm gonna type the latest number. All right, submit, withdrawal initiated, bingo. All right, so while that processed, uh, I'm gonna head again to the available to stake here. All right, that's showing the the unclaimed pre now, I, I just claimed, so now it's there. And now I need to wait for the withdrawal from Qcoin to arrive. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and deploy my server, my new server. I'm gonna choose Australia, just figure it's $5. I wanna expand my uh, geographical uh, distribution of all the all the nodes. Uh, so in this case, I, I did Australia, five dollars a month. Um, operating system. I changed this to an older version, 18.02 or four. I'm sorry, Ubuntu, 18.04. Um, gonna require a one-time password. You can email me that password, um, and then I'm gonna deploy it. All right, that's step number one, deploying the, the actual VPS. So while that is being deployed, let's go back to the instructions. So we're back at the instructions here. So now uh, while the VPS is being deployed, we need to connect uh, to the VPS using PuTTY. Um, so go ahead and, and download PuTTY. Um, what you wanna do is you wanna enter your IP address from, from the, the server you just deployed, right? So. Go ahead and get that from the server. Let's, let's click here. That's my server. I'm gonna copy. All right. That's my new server. Uh, I'm gonna call it 16. Save and let's open. First time you're gonna have to accept the security alert and then and then you get the login. So all right, once you get the login. You're gonna choose root as the login and the password you should get an email from, from the vendor. Once you log in with Patty, you're gonna be asked uh, to provide a password. The user ID is root. And then the password, you should have received an email with the password, type the password. Then you're gonna be asked uh, to re-enter a new password. So uh, go ahead and, and, and type a new password. All right, that's a new password, retype it. It's quite long. All right, and we are in. All right, let's go back to instructions and keep going. Now that we're connected to our server and we have changed the password, let's go ahead and copy and paste the following commands. Uh, we're gonna update uh, Docker right now. So let's go ahead and copy this, go back to party, right click, enter. All right, let's Ubuntu update. Let's write that. All right, first update finish, and then you are being asked, do you want to continue? After this operation, 333 megabytes of additional disk space will be used. I'm gonna say yes, need to aware of that, and it's gonna continue expanding and installing uh, the update. Okay, the update is done. Then we're gonna move to the next command, which is then add your current user to the Docker group, so you can directly run Docker commands. Click here, copy, 
go back to party, right click, enter. Okay, done. All right, step number four. For this step, you'll need to grab your registration code for nodespreset.org slash dashboard in order to utilize your node. All right, so remember we have our own registration code, right? So we're gonna go ahead first and open uh, Notepad. So just open Notepad, have it there. Then you're gonna go ahead and copy all this code there. Copy and paste it in Notepad. Then you're gonna go and get the registration code from your website, from your registration. So let's go to your pre-search nodes here. Launch a node, register, and that's your registration node. You're gonna copy that. It's right now it's hidden, but it's right there. Copy, go back to your uh, notepad where you paste your that text and where it says registration code equal dollar sign replaced from the dollar sign registration code here just replace it there okay after you replace it uh, you're gonna save that file keep in the folder just run call it pre-16 because I have this is my 16th all right and then I'm gonna copy the whole thing edit select all edit copy all right so I have all that there I'm gonna go back to my party and I'm gonna right click everything got pasted there enter all right so let it run after you replace it uh, you're gonna save that file keep in the folder just run call it pre-16 because I have this is my 16th all right, and then I'm gonna copy the whole thing. Edit, select all, edit, copy. All right, so I have all that there. I'm gonna go back to my party, and I'm gonna right click. Everything got pasted there, enter. All right, so let it run. Okay, now that we have our pre-search node up and running, Let's go back to our dashboard. See, you should see no listening for searches. It's listening for search. So let's go back to our no dashboards. And let's see, I have all my nodes here, see, named. And now I have this new node description. That means I have a new node there. It, it has today's date. So I know it's, this is the new one I just created. So go ahead and edit node. And we're gonna, here's where we're gonna stake the 4,000. So I'm gonna stake 4,000. Description, I'm gonna call it, this is my note 16. I always use the same description, pre-search and score 16. I want any external URL, uh, I'll all get what's pulled, send my email on disconnect and send me an email on reconnect so I know a notification if for some reason the server goes down or anything goes down with the note, I wanna know, I wanna, I wanna get notified. Um, so go ahead and click update node updated back to the list and now I should have a new node here with 4,000 at stake I still don't have a reliability uh, score but I will get one I'm gonna start earning pre tokens here you're gonna see them same way as, as I have here on the others you're also gonna get a reli reliability score every time uh, depending on how well your node does all right, so now I'm back to the list and I can see that my pre-search uh, 16th node, which we which, which just created with 4,000 stake, is already earning pre-tokens pre here. So it's been five minutes and it's already earning pre-tokens. Um, so there you are, you're gonna, you're gonna start earning your pre-tokens uh, and you're gonna see them here on the unclaimed pre-earn and you can claim them at any time and they're gonna become available here to stake or to sell them if you wanna monetize, right? So I hope you enjoyed the video. Let me know if you have any questions in the comment section. Have a great day, thank you.